Hey everyone, long time no see. Yes, I'm back. <laughs> I know, I think the last time that I had filmed was probably what, in May, I think? Maybe even like April? Sorry, I've been away. I've had some, a uh, lot of, a uh, lot of things happening in my life. Um, I had a major health um, thing go on that I probably did talk about maybe in my last video, um, but that has been resolved, so to say. <clears throat> I had my surgery. I'm fine now. My hair is actually grown back. Um, <clears throat> so yeah. So anyways, um, I've been putting off filming a lot of stuff mostly because I have been busy with um, other things and kind of lazy <laughs> to film, but because I finally got my Hobonichi order, um, I felt like I needed to go ahead and document this. So let's get started. So this is the 2024 Hobonichi haul. Um, I ordered on September 1st when uh, they opened the website to orders and I got my, my order in within three minutes, but then I didn't get it until today because it got held up in customs. I don't know if this was an, an issue with the new uh, company that Hobonichi is using to fulfill the orders because I have a feeling that they did not include the, you know how like they usually put a packing slip inside. I don't think they did with mine because my order had shipped last week but then it got held up in customs and at first i thought well that's kind of weird maybe they're just there's just a backlog at customs but it turns out that uh i had to fill out a document just to get the uh order and what was holding it up was pen inks that i ordered the um refills for the what do you call this for the hobonichi sarasa pen is it sarasa no jet stream pens all because it contained chemicals or something like that so weird so i had to fill this form out sent it back and then it said it was going to ship the next day and then it didn't ship it said it got held up again and then the next day it shipped so weird but anyways let's go ahead and get started so um i think some people were kind of complaining how plain the color was for the boxes but it's a box i don't care yeah i store some my hobonichi stuff in the boxes but it's no big deal all right so this right here is the free gift that you get when you order, I believe the, um, when you order a planner. So I only ordered, uh, the A6, I think it's Monday start. I think I meant to order Sunday, but that's okay. And this is what I got. Oh, yay. I got the onigiri. So, so cute. And I'm glad I got this because I like the color too. It's just a little, a little bag, a little tote not sure what um i'm gonna do with it but it's still cute nonetheless you know hobonichi likes to always give an exclusive gift um, when you order a planner so yeah that's really cute all right i hope i am in not so much in focus but within frame okay so this year i only ordered one cover and as you can probably already see a peek of it um i stuck with the a6 because um, I felt like it's working, it's working out for me this year, uh, over than the A5. I've, before the last two years, I've been doing A5, but it is a lot of space and I do write a lot, but my style kind of changed this year, especially after my trip to San Francisco. Um, there's just so much that I had to write with it about the four days, but there was no way I could, I could put it, you know all down on an A6 page. So I came up with the idea of just doing um, bullets and that's kind of worked out. And then if I feel like I want to expand on, you know, what happened, then what I did order, what I did start using was the day free in an A5. So I didn't order a cover because I did order the A5 um, uh, day free for next year, but I have plenty of A5 covers. So, you know, I just felt like I don't need to spend the extra money for one. So yeah, so this is going to be my first time um, using or bought purchasing a Liberty um, cover. And it, I was torn between this and getting the little gifts cover, which everybody seemed to order. I mean, I was that close to ordering it, but I decided to go with this because um, I don't know, I just wanted something a little bit brighter, you know? And this just really caught my eye. I love the muted colors. 
So, and I, I just love, yeah, I just love this, this grayish green color. So um, I went ahead and just got this. I kind of do regret a little bit not ordering the little gifts, but that's okay. I, I don't really need it. <laughs> I mean, yeah, everybody's hyped it up and they're all, you know, talking about it in every video and on the Hobonichi groups in, um, on Facebook, but wow. So it, yeah, this is nice. I do like it. It's very pretty. And then of course, like I said, I did get the English, um, January start one day page. Uh, this, I know this has got to be the Monday. Yeah, it probably is. So I'll put this back in the cover, but, um, yeah, so this is going to be what I'll be using next year. Um, I did get this cover right here. Now I'm not going to use it obviously on the Hollyhocks, but, um, I do have some plain a six and you know, I always want to get the, um, the cover on cover, I guess you could say exclusive, whatever you want to call it of the year. So I just went ahead and ordered this. I forgot what it's called, but, um, I have plenty of clear ones, which I'll use on, on that. So have that now something new, my first, I ordered a week's <laughs> what I plan on doing with this week's, um, next year is this will be my, um, fitness, uh, planner journal, I guess you could say, because I started going to the gym, um, sometime, I think it was mid July. And, um, so far it's been good. I, I tend to go, I would say four to five times a week, you know, right now, all I'm doing is cardio. Um, because my job involves me sitting down a lot. I try to get up every hour when my watch it tells me to, and I, w I try to walk up at least, you know, one to two flights. A, um, well, I wouldn't say, well, I walk up one flight at least. So I probably try to do that at least four to five times a day, you know, just to be, just to be active. But because I sit down a lot, um, I do at least 50 minutes of cardio, um, at the gym and it's mostly on the treadmill. So I've been steadily increasing the incline. Um, I think I've found the right speed for me, but yeah, definitely the incline. So that way, you know, trying to get that heart rate up at least to like, you know, 138, 140, um, beats a minute. And, um, yeah, so far so good. Um, one other thing is that I'm on Ozempic. Yes. I got diagnosed with diabetes. So, I have a legit reason to be on it. Um, I've already, I started that at the beginning of this month. So I've already started losing weight. I'm on the second week right now and I've already lost a total of eight pounds. So, um, yeah, so I'm going to use this to kind of track, um, all of that. And, um, yeah, I chose like this kind of like pale um, mint color and, um, yeah, I'm excited because, you know, everybody always talks about the weeks and I have always kind of like, uh, I don't really need it. I mean, I already have, you know, the A6, I already have the regular planner, but I don't want to fill up each day in the A6 with just, especially if there's not really much going on. I don't want to have to write about, you know, my fitness there. I want to kind of keep that separate. So, um, that's why I went ahead and got it. What's this? Oh, that's interesting. I'll look at that later. Wow. Okay. Nice. Yeah. So this will be good because then I can put down my steps. Um, you know, the information that my watch is tracking and then, um, also like, uh, I guess what else can I put on there? Um, I guess like my goal, was I able to stay on target in terms of like for my glucose, things like that. So that's probably what I will use this for. So then, you know, I can bring this with me to the doctor when I have my checkups, you know, um, even though they can download, um, all the info cause I have the Libre in my arm, um, excuse me, inserted <laughs> into my arm. Um, but I always like to have it at least, uh, written down, you know, or printed out kind of thing. So I did purchase the, um, the cover on cover and I got this one, which is really cute. So I'm going to, I'm curious as to how that's going to look. Wow. It looks really big. I hope I got, yeah, there we go. 
I guess it'll fit. But either way, um, I think that'll look really cute. So I got that. What else we got here? Okay. So here's the evil <laughs> refills that I ordered. I got black because I did a project in the spring for a friend as a gift, a birthday gift. And I did use, um, I don't think this is last year's. I think I, I used whatever last year's pen was and I was mostly using the black and I, I know for sure that I almost used up all the ink. So I don't know why it just never dawned on me that, yeah, I could replace the inks. <laughs> but now I ordered this so that way I know what um, ink I can purchase because I am going back to San Francisco next month. I'll be there for like nine days and I'm going to go back to Mito and I'm going to buy a whole bunch of these so I don't have to order from jet pens, pay the shipping, whatever, wait. So at least I know, okay, these are the type of refills. So I got the refills because I ordered, um, I ordered the weeks. I got the A6 uh, planner. And I also, you'll see here the day free, I was able to get three pens. And I love that these pens really match everything that I ordered. I mean, kind of, but definitely this one this goes so well you know so um yeah I'm happy with the pens and the evil refills i was kind of surprised about this <laughs> i was like i know i didn't order this but i guess it's another gift what is it anyways tissue i guess it's tissue All right, let's open it there's stickers i don't think i ordered this See, because it's weird because my order did not come with the packing slip. So I'd have to go on the website or my on my email and check to see. I think this is tissue, you know. Yeah, I think so. Oh, look at that. What? What is this? You know, I don't know. Who knows? I'll look it up. That's just strange. Okay. And so I ordered some pencil boards. I didn't go crazy. There were some more that I wanted to get and I got the folders. So I did get the little gifts, um, a six folders. I just thought they were really cute. So it's the only thing that I got. I think there's three of them in here. Um, I'll probably use them, um, to insert stuff for my trip, you know, like receipts and business cards, and stuff like that, because I do want a memory journal and I'll probably use that within a traveler's insert, traveler's notebook insert. So yeah, that's really cute. Um, get that. I got this um, pencil board for the A6 and this was from, I think this is new for this year. I almost purchased um, the Weeks with this design, the, bota uh, wow, the botanical design, but instead I, I opted for the green. So I got the custom board also for um, the Weeks. But yeah, they're really cute. I did not get an A5. I don't need one. I have plenty of pencil boards. All right, so the very last thing that I got was here it is the um, day three. It always, I'm always surprised at how small or thin the day three is, but you know, you don't really need a lot of pages. I mean, it's just, you know, so just an extra. So if, you know, you're writing and you want to expand more, then this is what this is for. So yeah, because I think one of the answers that I wrote for just one day <laughs> during my vacation, I think I used up three pages. So, um, yeah, it's not for like every day. It's only for special things. Um, I could probably still use the one that I have for this year, for next year, because there's no point really. I mean, I don't really use the calendar and this is just as a backup, you know, just in case if I ended up filling it up, which like I said, I didn't, but then I really do need to go back and um, fill up more entries um, or expand because like I said, a lot of stuff happened. So that's what I, that's why, I, you know, I keep it just in case and make sure. Yeah, see, nothing in terms of uh, like a, what do you, whatever you call it, packing slip. 
So let me go ahead and arrange everything so prettily, prettily here. But yeah, this is all the things that I ordered for my um, 2024 Hobonichi haul. Uh, I don't really get much during the spring one. It's only if there's a particular cover that I have to have. But did I, even, I, I know I ordered this year, but I don't even remember now what I ordered to begin with. <laughs> kind of sad. Um, but yeah, so I'm excited to use this for next year. And um, hopefully, you know, Hopefully next year will be good and I'm not gonna breach my deductible on my insurance that quickly. Although it's great because I don't have to pay for a lot of stuff now, but still, um, yeah, I know. I need to go ahead and start like um, scheduling stuff because I don't have to pay anything. But um, yeah, it'd be kind of nice to not have to <sighs> spend a lot of my savings on medical <laughs> you know, issues. So um, there you go. All right, so I've got some other videos I need to film, and I'm, then I've got to edit all this. So I hope everyone's going to have a good weekend. All right, bye.